before we start this video, be sure to stay tuned to the end of the video to see the end of season stats and who won the MVP and Rookie of the Year. P.S. I probably won Rookie of the Year. We don't know. All right, what is going on, everybody? And welcome back to this Karan Lewis, my career. We are going to play the last game of the regular season against the worst team in the NBA. Yes, the Charlotte Hornets, but the reason why I'm facing them is I have history with the Hornets in this game. I always lose to them. And I get to match up against Devin Booker. Devin Booker leaves the Suns, who have not made a playoff since he's been drafted, and goes to the Hornets and still doesn't make the playoffs and is, once again, the worst team in the league. And he almost he shot 53% from the field, nearly 50% from three, and almost 90% from the free throw line in only 32 minutes. He is so unlucky, it's unbelievable. I actually don't know how this team was that bad. This team is actually not that bad on paper, but I get I guess if Milos is your third point guard on the roster, I don't know. But let's jump to this game against the Charlotte Hornets. Here we are in Philadelphia for our last game of the regular season. The last seed Hornets facing the best team in the league, the Philadelphia 76ers, led by Karan Lewis and Paul George, the dynamic duo. This team defensively is insane. Uh, I hope we can spank up the um, Hornets, but you never know what could happen. And obviously the matchup of the day is Devin Booker versus Karan Lewis. Similar stats and points, but the rebounds and assists is a whole different story. Oh, Devin Booker shooting right away. He misses. And um, I am on a two-year deal with the Sixers, so I will be back next year. So I will not have to change teams. I will be with the Sixers next year. We don't know what the roster is going to look like because some players have one-year deals. But as of now, I'm staying with the Sixers. Paul George, I see you on Jarrett Jackson. Who? Uh, I mean, Jarrett Jackson. What? That's Jarrett Allen. I'm dumb. By the way, I forgot to mention, if you were new here, be sure to subscribe for NBA content every day as Booker is going to miss another three. He is not doing well, and he's their only hope of winning this game. As I'm dry Why did I pull up? Why, 2K, would I pull up in the paint in front of someone? That makes the least sense possible. Devin Booker taking another three. He's missing again. He's ice cold. He's getting locked down as I'm going to go up for my first points. How is that 9 and 1? Devin Booker's finally going to score his first points with the three. Why did we give it to Miles Turner that far down? I don't know why. Give it to me. Devin Booker. I really want to break his ankles, but I don't think that's going to happen. But I will pull up for three and clank it. Oh, draining the three. I wasn't expecting to hit that. I missed the leaning mid. Miles Turner got the rebound, popped it right back to me. Bang, three. Oh, Kyle Anderson is not hitting a three. Never, never, ever, ever will he hit a three. I see you. Paul, all right. He's a very good defender, Paul, so he can't just do that. Reggie Jackson has five points. He is a big reason why it is a five-point game. He's got half of their points. Oh, Devin Booker touched the floor. Oh, they need a timeout after that one. Oh, they're getting subbing me out after that three. Up by eight. All right, we're up by 15. Ooh, what a shot. Oh, that was a mid. That was amazing. Get that out of here, Gallinari. I play defense, and so does Zubac. That's three in a row. Oh, uh, and Sham is going to hit a three. No, he missed. And that, okay, he, the rebounds is an issue. Sham, I froze him. Hit that shot. Looking like Kobe. Give me that. Got the steal. No one's running. Someone start running, Jay Rich. You got it. Throw it down or throw up the green bean. I mean, subbed out. Up by 18. And we're up by 14 going at halftime. I will take it. Wait a minute. I do not have 16 assists. I wish I did, but that has to be a visual glitch. Unless I blanked out that whole second quarter and got like 10 assists in a row. No, I have 7 assists. Wow. That, that was weird. I've never seen that glitch before. Why did it say I have 16? Oh, whatever the case is, we're back in the third quarter up by 14, and I'm pulling up for my mid-range shot, knocking it down. Jay Rich, once again, in the lane, greens it. He's got 10 points in this game. Give me that, give me that. D-Book, what you doing? Okay, I don't know. I couldn't find anyone. Duh, oh, Paul, that was a dumb shot. Oh, Miles Turner. Oh, I left Evan Booker wide open for three, but he's been garbage this game. John Collins with a big rebound. I was not expecting him to get that, but I'm expecting... 
Nah, I wasn't expecting Devin Booker to block me. I'm in the lane. I'm in the lane. Look at that. Inbound! That's my play. Just get right into the lane. No one's ever in it. Give me that. Look at that. I'm an NFL cornerback. I see you, Jay Rich. Pull up. Please hit this. That was such a beautiful pass. Good job, Jay Rich. I'm driving down with the block. I'm going to throw it down. I'm sorry, Jay Rich. This time, I want my points. I see Paul George. I see you, my guy. I see you, my guy. Put it up. Ah, oh, my goodness. He hit... Ah, oh, 2K, you're on something. Dennis Smith Jr. with the steal. You know, I'm just going to let him run the floor. Throw it down, Dennis. Or get fouled. All right, you can sub me out now, coach. Or keep me in the game. That's all good. Oh, my God. What a dunk. What was that? I can't even calculate that. He spun so fast. Paul George, drive to the lane. Throw it up. And one for Paul George. We are up by 34 points. Throw up the lob. Oh, give it to Paul George! I didn't even see him! The Hornets have only scored 5 points in this entire quarter. 7 points, I'm sorry. This entire quarter. Can we hold him to under 10? I mean, it's a possibility. Oh my god, how is that a foul, 2K? Oh, and he's going to make it, isn't he? Yep, he made it. Wow, they still have, like, no points. Get that out of here, D-Book. Dude, I'm a defensive monster. Give it to me. I'm in the lane. I'm going to throw it down. Jay Rich has five fouls, dude. Oh, my God. Why are they tripling me? You lost. You're down by 40. Why are you triple teaming me? They're going to sub me out finally. Don't let them score 100. And they scored 100. Well, we won by 42. My one goal was I didn't want them to score 100. But that somehow happened because of the bumps we had in the game. Doesn't matter, we got the win. Final stats of the game, I did drop 45 points, 8 rebounds, 16 assists with 3 steals and 3 blocks. I did have 5 turnovers. Some of them weren't my fault, but most of them were. 18 for 28, 2 for 4, I just dominated. Paul George had 29 with 3 steals. He did everything out there. Same thing with Jay Rich, 14. Dennis Smith off the bench had 4 steals and 14 points. Our team all around was just extremely good. Now, I can't say the same for the Hornet side. Now, one person scored 20, and Booker got completely clamped. He only had 19 points, a rebound, and a block. He shot 6 for 18 and 3 for 8, and was a minus 30. Reggie Jackson was actually decent, but shot horrific. And that's the same thing for the rest of the team. No one did good. Their best player was Kyle Anderson, which isn't good. And with the end of that game, Stephen Curry wins your MVP. I am the Rookie of the Year. TJ McConnell wins Sixth Man of the Year somehow. Uh, Kawhi Leonard, Defense Player of the Year. Marvin Bagley, Most Improved. And Brett Brown, Coach of the Year. Here are your All-NBA teams. Neither of Paul George or I made the first team or the second team. We made the third team, though. Okay, I, I don't know how we only made the third team. I averaged 26. Yeah, I'm not even going to complain. We both averaged 26 but didn't make uh, the first team. Uh, All-Defensive team, I'm not on either of them. That's bullcrap. But we will be facing the Indiana Pacers in the first round. Although the Heat clinched the playoffs, they got knocked out somehow. I don't understand. Yeah, it says they made the playoffs. Apparently, 10 teams made the playoffs, according to 2K. So, there you go. Good job, 2K. But we are facing the Indiana Pacers in the first round. This is what their team's looking like. This should be an easy sweep. I forget. I think it's the same thing as... Harold Johnson, you played, it's a three-game series. I might be wrong. But this is the playoff bracket, all right? Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. GG.